With the burden of infectious diseases in this part of the globe, the emerging threat of non-communicable diseases was for a long time neglected. These non-communicable diseases has caught up in our part of the world and has not only become a big threat, but a clear and present danger. Leading amongst these are the cardiovascular, diabetes and cancer burdens. In Ghana, breast, cervical and prostate cancers are the leading cancers in women and men respectively. So just narrowing down on the breast cancer problem, um, the sad aspect of it is that most people in these parts of the world actually get diagnosed very late. This is because they don't know the early signs and symptoms. And when you look at the healthcare system, most GPs are also not able to pick up patients very early and refer them to the appropriate specialist for treatment. This leads to most cases presenting late and us having lower survival rate, which leads us with a challenge. What can we do as AstraZeneca to make this situation better and improve the outcome? AstraZeneca, through its Enidaso initiative, is taking a multifaceted approach into addressing this problem. The uniqueness of Enidaso lies in the fact that it's partnering with the public health care delivery system, the private system, as well as support groups and organizations into making a holistic approach in addressing this problem. Enidaso aims at training hundreds of healthcare practitioners. These will range from specialists right through GPs to nurses. We would also look at training other caregivers, NGOs, other organizations, and even corporate bodies who have set aside a commitment to taking breast cancer as part of their corporate social responsibility. Some of those we wish to partner would create the awareness Others would ultimately be caregivers and others will support the system to ensure that ultimately the patient is the winner. The Nidaso Initiative has been applauded at the highest level of healthcare delivery in Ghana, having been launched jointly by the First Lady of the Republic of Ghana and the Minister of Health, who coincidentally is also a woman. The final arm of Nidaso is aimed at improving access to medication as well as making it affordable to the patient in Ghana. Through some of these activities, including scientific knowledge sharing and collaboration with various stakeholders, AstraZeneca would ensure that the patients and the community are the heart and center of all its activities and ultimately create a win-win situation wherever we operate. The benefit will impact thousands of women in Ghana. Enidaso has been highly applauded and it is our hope that we take such laudable initiatives and set a new level and a new standard for responsible ethical business.